Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So this is about PS University Bangalore which has two campus and I'm going to cover the complete placements for last 2-3 year information as well as the 2024 placement as it is uh, going on currently. Before that, that, so here is a short campus tour first of the PS Electronic City campus. So they two have two engineering campus, one at the PS University Electronic City. So this is that beautiful campus very close to IT zone and the companies are there. So this is a modern infrastructure campus and uh, the second campus which is there. And this is the main campus which is the Ring Road campus. So this is the campus which started earlier and part of the PESIT, PESIT and along with the PES University Electronic City campus both have the common placement. So that is the overall details for the so it is also important to understand the total number of seats which are available in each of the campus before understanding the placement and the number of placed students. So you can see this is Ring Road campus, biotechnology 60 seats. Computer Science Engineering uh, 720 seats and CSC with AIML branch 480 seats and then Electrical and Electronics Engineering 60 seats. So there are large number of seats in computer side as you can see here and if you further see the ECE has got 360 seats and Mechanical Engineering has got 60 seats. So if you see total number of seats which are now available in the Ring Road campus itself is 1740 which is a very big number. Now if you talk about the second campus which is the Electronic City campus. So there are CSC branch which has 720 seats then there is CSC with AIML that also has 240 seats and then there is a third branch EC Electronics and Communication Engineering which also has 180 seats. So if you to see total seats in EC branch it is 1140 and now if you see the total seat across both the Ring Road campus and the EC campus put together it's a 2900 seats which is a very big number and most of the seats are like CSC and EC students so almost 2500 seats are from CSC or CSC specialization branches and EC which will give a big competition. And talking about the fee structure for this year 2024, like if you are getting through PESIT and the J means of admission process, then per year fees is like 480,000 for computer science and CSE AIML branches. For electronics and communication branch, the fees is 420,000. And for other branches, which is mechanical, electrical, and biotechnology, the fees is around 380,000. And all the students are also need to give. 10,000 as one time fees and now if you are joining through you know KCET exam KSET exam then the fees will be like 96,574 which is CET quota then you have to pay one time fees of 10,000 rupees and also there will be additional college fees of around 30 to 40,000 so total it will be like 1.4 lakhs now jumping to the NIRF placement details which are available for last three years and then I will cover the 2024 placement later. So 2021 batch right around uh, 1088 students got placed and the median salary was 7.3 lakhs and around 134 student went for the higher studies. So 7.3 lakhs median salary in the next year like 2022 batch around 1184 students got placed which increased by 100 students and the median salary also increased to 7.5 lakhs and now 2023 passing batch the total number of placed students are 1199 that is very close to 1200 but the total batch size is now 2900 so you can understand there will be a big competition and the median salary also slowly increased to 8 lakhs so median salary is between 7 to 8 lakh for last three years and that is expected to be in the same range but the number of students who has gone for the higher studies you can see in the last column is like 238 students which is a bigger number now so that way placement will have an impact with every increase in the seats now talking about some of the higher offers which are there in the you know PES University so and this includes both the campuses Ring Road as well as the Electronic City so 52 lakhs salary for three students with the company DE Shaw 44 lakhs package with for one student in into it and these are quite good salaries but mostly these salaries have gone to the computer science or CSE related branches 
next you see the higher salaries like uh, 33 lakhs package for five students with Commvault, similar th 33 lakhs package for two students in observe.ai and 32 lakhs package for two more students in company Cohesity, which can also be considered as a decent uh, offer. Now moving further, 29 lakh salary for four students with Morgan Stanley, which is a global MNC and 27 lakhs package with three students with Pure Storage, which is also a very good company and 27 lakhs package with the couch based company for four students. So these are quite good offers. Another good offers which are there like 24 lakh salary of Cisco around four students and 24.62 again with SAP Labs. Uh, five students and then 24 lakhs package for two students with the company ring central so these are all top notch mnc's and these are the packages which are above 2024 20, 25 lakhs rest of the packages will be in the range of you know 6 lakhs to 12 lakhs which is the most uh, predominant range where the maximum students will get placed and then some offers will be below 6 lakhs also and the average salary is around median salary is around 8 lakhs which you saw earlier so that's all a short update thanks for watching this and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all the colleges in karnataka